Tan Games here. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, another video for you today. Um, we are slowly, slowly almost finished with this stuff. Um, now, unfortunately, hanging out with a blue and purple villager, chat with the best jokester in the business, dig for shiny white gems, cook a lancet fish dish, and give a magical matron her favourite gifts requires me to have a bunch of dream light. Basically, I need to open up the Forgotten Lands and I also need to open up the Monsters Inc. Realm and both of them cost 15,000 Dreamlight. So I will hopefully at some point soon be able to open up one of them. Um, but one of the tasks is to cook something sweet and cold with apples. Now for that, I do need some of the ice stuff, the slush ice. Um, but sadly, uh, we don't have slush ice in our Remy's at the moment. So I'm hoping we could maybe do some Remy quests and then hopefully we can get the slush ice. Um, I do think it's his like level seven quest, um, which I can talk to him and interact Excuse with him and we should be able help? to start. Oh, <laughs> I just entered his house. <laughs> we should hopefully be able to start that Hello. quest line. I'm hoping. Um, Bonjour. Bonjour. Uh... Do, 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 do. The great gap. Oh god, I don't know what this is. <laughs> Which one do I need to do? Uh. Oh, hold on. Does it say in the quest? <laughs> so I know a free course thank you is that one, but this one doesn't have a name. Oh, the great gathering. That's a Simba one. Book hunt is a bell one. Okay, so it must be the other one. But, uh, why don't I say let's hang out just so that he's getting some points whilst we do any things. And let's do the price of fame because I'm assuming that's his main storyline quest. Uh, Tanya, thank goodness you're here. I have an amazing problem. Oh. Shay Remy is a hit. We have more customers than I can handle by myself. Uh, congratulations. Uh... Thank you. Right, okay, back to work. Okay. Huh? Did I do something wrong there? Uh -huh. I have an amazing problem. Uh, we have more. Huh? Congratulations. Why can I not? Uh -oh. Do I have to press the other one? That's an amazing problem. Can I help you? Yes, please. I really uh -huh. need it. Okay. Apparently that was me choosing not to help him by saying congratulations. Here, take this chef uniform, put it on, and meet me in the kitchen. Perhaps we could do something together. Okay. <laughs> Let's put this on. Okay, and then uh, the price of fame. Let's track this. Uh, price of fame. You look great. Very professional. Now I need you to watch out for customers entering Shea Remy. They can come in at any time, but some have their patterns. Uh -huh. Goofy always visits for lunch, and I see Merlin in the morning and at night. When you see a customer come in, fill their order while I handle some executive chef stuff. Oh no, I already fed a bunch of customers. Oh thank god, we're like a minute two. Um, so hopefully we get another customer, <laughs> but I literally, one, two, three, four people, I literally fed four people just before this. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. So why don't I, um, whilst I'm waiting for that, why don't I do this free course thank you? Let's find Merlin and Scrooge and stuff like that, and we can do that quest. Oh, um, a free course thank you. Yeah, I'm sure he would like an egg. <laughs> He's a duck. <laughs> I mean, that's probably like cannibalism, but still. I know that's about as fine a meal as I've ever seen. Are you just giving something like that away for free? Consider it a little thank you payment from me and Remy for taking care of the village during the forgetting. Thank you, Mr. McDuck, for... Giving me a discount on my next purchase, hopefully. <laughs> I can't blame you for trying, though. I can't go giving away discounts like that. But don't think I don't appreciate the gesture. 
A wee bit of gratitude is worth more than all the gold in the Yukon. In the sentiment, that is. Okay. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. Where's Merlin, Mickey and Goofy then? Mickey's over here by his house. Merlin's by his. And Goofy is nowhere to be seen. Oh, he's down there. Just so I've got an idea, they like they could move around as the time goes, but yeah. Uh, a free horse, thank you. Let's give him the pickled herring. Oh boy, what did I do to deserve this delicious looking meal? I whipped it up with a little help from Remy. We wanted to thank everyone who took care of the village during the forgetting. It's our way of showing gratitude to you for... Doing all the gardening around here. Oh, well, I do my best, but it's nice to have somebody here who's got the magic touch again. Thanks, Tanya. With you and Remy around, I just know this village is going to keep getting better and better. Okay. And then Merlin was down here, if I remember correctly. And then Goofy's in the glade. I don't want to pick up the flower. There we go. Uh, here, you can have some Arendellian pickled herring too. Mm -hmm. Well then, what's all this? <laughs> I don't recall requesting such an extravagant meal, though I am a bit peckish. It's a thank you meal, courtesy of me and Remy. We wanted to show our gratitude to you for taking care of this village during the forgetting and for being... Uh... Even more marvellous than oh, indoor plumbing. <laughs> oh, well, I must be marvellous indeed, mustn't I? <laughs> Actually, I'm... Well, I'm afraid I haven't the faintest idea what to say. I suppose... Hmm, I suppose I never expected a thank you. I was simply doing what was right. Um... You're welcome, should cover it. <laughs> I expect it would. Uh -huh. You're most welcome. Acts of kindness like this meal are what holds this valley together, Tanya. Okay. And then Goofy was down here. I just want to check he still is before I run all the way down. Yeah. See, he's not even close to being there. Where is he? Where did he go? Oh, he's behind us. Oh, he's up there. Behind Mickey's house. Don't you go anywhere, Goofy. Oh my god, Mirabelle just sliding along. Hi there, pal. Great to see you, pal. Uh, a free course, thank you. Here you go. Gosh, this smells delicious, Tanya. Who's it for? It's a little gift from me and Remy to you. Thanks for... Watching over the royal fishing rod. Ah, oh, shucks, I'm speechless. Uh, to Goofy? Oh, sorry, pal. I was just being speechless, like I said. Thanks, Tanya. I can't wait to get my favourite double-ended fork, spoon and dig in. <laughs> well, enjoy. Um, now, where's Remy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I forgot I'm hanging out with him, and I? Uh, a free mm -hmm. course, thank you. Hey, Tanya, you're back. Did you have time to bring those meals to Merlin, Mickey, M Mr. McDuck and Goofy? How did they react? Did they enjoy them? Uh, of course they enjoyed them. I made them. <laughs> right, I don't know why I even asked. You could turn burnt toast into a five-star meal. And hey, while you were taking care of all of that, I thought of a special meal I could make for you. You're not going to make me gather the ingredients, are you? <laughs> no, no, no. Don't worry. I already made it. Here you go. One free course thank you for everything you do around here. Bon appetit. Okay, we got a salad. We got ratatouille. And we got a banana split. Not bad. Not too shabby. Right, I'm going to quickly run into Remy's and hopefully there's someone new there, if not a couple of people at least. 
That would be helpful. Okay, there's two. Three. Okay, right. Perfect. Okay, so veggie pasta, tekamaki, and fruit salad. Okay. Let's have a look. Uh, tekamaki. <gasps> we add one for that. It was veggie pasta then, wasn't it? And then a fruit salad. Uh, oh god, what shall I drop? Drop the flower. And then... Uh, what was the other thing? Fruit salad. And then maybe we can drop... Uh, this. Okay. Am I even going to be able to get that? Probably not while Simba's there. Okay. Hey, hey, good to see you. Uh, I have your order. Here's your fruit salad. Enjoy. Ah. Oh, I need that order. I'm trying so hard to get it and I don't think I can because Simba's there. Oh, that's a shame. Oh well. Okay, I have your order. She's level 10, so... No bonuses for that. And then Mother Gothel, she's she can probably be leveled up. Uh, I have your order. <laughs> Is this really the best thing you can think to give to me? Just kidding, darling. I love it. So horrible. Okay, there we go. And return to Remy. Bonjour. Uh, the price of fame. There we go. Thank you so much, Tanya. While you were covering my or orders, I organised the kitchen. Sharpened the knives, coordinated the spice rack... Now I can fill orders fast enough to handle things on my own. But you were great. Please come back any time you'd like. Yeah. Okay, do I have to get him to like level 10? How on earth do I get this stuff? <laughs> oh my days. Oh no, I can't pick these up. Oh wait, I can just this i can't pick up at the moment oh joy okay i'm gonna leave and come back in because sometimes doing little things like that can help doesn't always but sometimes no but i was able to get this memory which is something oh no i can't okay right i had this glitch before i'm gonna have to restart in order to get anywhere um but that hasn't helped me, so maybe if we upgrade oh, Remy's again. Nice. I think it oh, just gives extra Steven. settings, but Coffee. we've got the money, so we might as well. Yeah. Okay, so we have Remy's fully upgraded now, which is nice. Hmm. But still, none of this. Which is a shame. Okay. Well then, I'm thinking perhaps he's level 9 at the moment. I have a bunch of okra that I need to harvest and stuff. Um, so I'm going to do that. I am going to plant these candy seeds though. Um, so, just so that you're aware of that. Um... Water them and harvest them. Okay. But I don't want to do that. Where's... Is Remy on here? Okay, Remy level 10. So there's not really anything I can change in terms of tracking. Um, oh yeah, we're still not quite there yet. 
Um, but yeah, what I'll either do, I'll either cut it out of the editing or do like a fast forward um, of me gardening. <laughs> Basically, I need to harvest all this okra. Um, and once I've harvested the okra, I can... Um, Yeah, I, I, hopefully Remy will be level 10 and then maybe that will help me get the slush ice, I'm hoping. Um, if not, I might have to Google it. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to continue harvesting and uh, we'll be right back.
Okay, so we have Remy at level 10. Hopefully that's what we need for the, um, what do you call it? The, uh, the quest so that I can get the slush eyes. Um, cause it does look like new quest available. Yes. Okay. Let's talk to him. Bonjour. Uh, the unknown flavor. Okay. So I have an idea almost like the memory. It seems like there are memories all over this valley. Anyway, I can half remember a dish I made once. It was frozen sweet, a dessert. There was something magical about it. Um, listening to you makes me hungry. I'm going to go get something to eat. Well, if you're hungry, I know a guy with a restaurant. Oh my God, this is those things, mate. <laughs> it's like saying, I don't want to do the quest. <laughs> Okay, um, if it's magic, Merlin might know about it. I could go ask him. That would be great. If he thinks of anything, let me know. Okay, let's go talk to Merlin, who's down by his house. But this is good. He mentioned Frozen, so this absolutely has to be how we get the slush. Remy's thinking about food that feels magical. Fascinating. Magical? Sweet? Frozen? Well, the obvious person to ask is Elsa, but I assume Remy wishes to create this himself. You best examine the notes in my library. I believe there's a volume on enchanted food. Okay, let's go into the library. That's the potato quest. Oh yeah, the one, two, three, four. Okay. Oh, this is sparkling. Is there anything else in here at the moment? No. Just checking before I leave. Still think we need these smaller shelves. I love these shelves, but just wish we had the, um, the smaller version. Because technically you can get these shelves, but they're much larger. And I quite like this small size. I think it's kind of good. Like, it doesn't feel oversized. Um, but yeah. Uh, gather purified nightshard. Oh, God. This is where I'm going to have to grind again. Because I bet you I don't have enough. Because um, I bet you I need the darker nightshards, I think. I have a feeling. Purified nightshard. Okay, yeah, I need these ones. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to have to go around and dig.
who can turn it into powder? I would guess maybe Wally? Hmm. Perhaps, like, Wally crushes stuff. Like he's a trash compactor. Uh, the unknown flavour. Hi Wally, could you do me a favour and crush these shards into powder? Ta-da! Thanks Wally! Whoopee! And then I have to craft the slush ice. Sorry, ice slush. Oh thank god I had enough snowballs. Uh, the unknown flavour, here you are. <laughs> okay, we have ice slush and it's shimmery. I wonder if it will even melt. <laughs> well, I say we test it out with a classic recipe, vanilla rice cream. Would you like to do the honours? Here's the recipe. And then ice cream. Oh, I might have to grow some sugar. <laughs> I think I'm out of sugar cane. How long does sugar cane take to grow? Uh, seven minutes. Oh, that's not too bad at least. Okay, let me grab some. At some point I'm going to have to do like a mass planting of sugarcane for like the candy path. The good news is I can now open up the uh, Forgotten Lands. I noticed in one of my other videos a while back I kept meaning to talk about the frosted heights and i kept calling it the forgotten lands and it was so annoying when i was watching back and listening to it because i was like why are you even saying that why <laughs> i was so frustrated with myself gonna pick up that egg okay i'm gonna let this grow and we will be back in a few minutes maybe whilst i'm waiting for that to grow i'll go empty my inventory and stuff and then uh i'll just cut out the waiting part uh because no one wants to see that so yeah see you in a minute okay now that's done i can make the vanilla ice cream uh Vanilla ice cream. I was a bit confused at first because I checked whilst I was waiting and I was like, I don't have any slush ice. So you actually buy it from Remy's. So I just hadn't realised. <laughs> yeah! Smooth and sweet vanilla ice cream. It's a classic for a reason. Mm. So Tanya, you've been spending a lot of time in the kitchen with me. Mm. I think it's about time you had your very own kitchen shelf. That way the kitchen in your house will feel like a real restaurant kitchen. But you know that you're always welcome here so we can cook together. Yay! Okay, I'll put that here. That looks quite nice there. 
Okay, and then we're done. We're done with that Remy quest, but we now have enough slush eyes that we should be able to make the... Uh, you have to use apples. You have to use slush ice. And then you have to use the sugar cane. And it makes like apple ice... Apple sorbet. That's it. Apple sorbet. Um, and now we can just repeat that process another nine more times <laughs> and then we can get that task done which will be amazing okay i think that should be all of them if i'm correct yes Ooh, nice oh my god this is so good to see because if you look at that these are our final tasks that we need to do and with that as well if you have a look completed 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 and the last thing we had to do was to get mike oh my goodness Okay, and now we've unlocked this page and with every 10 tokens we can get 90 moonstones, which is so good. So at least as far as I'm concerned, I have finished the star path. Um, the only thing I need to, so uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that's what, 900 moonstones I'm potentially yeah yeah that's like 900 moonstones if i don't get these duties done that's about 900 which would be a shame to miss out on um but that being said i think we can probably get some of this done um i am gonna because now i've got enough dreamlight to open up the forgotten lands i am definitely gonna do that um and then hopefully that will start triggering things to get fairy godmother in or at least i can get the lancet fish and with the time that we've got at the moment we have 17 days i should easily be able to in 17 days get enough dreamlight to open the monsters ink universe and then get them in um yeah that should give us plenty of time um, why don't I press E to investigate? Hello. Have you been to the Forgotten Lands yet? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you haven't. The path there is blocked by nightfalls. You'd best clear those out. Okay, let's clear it. Bravo, Tanya, your path to the Forgotten Lands is clear. <gasps> and it looks like Fairy Godmother's house is all ready activated oh my goodness okay that is really exciting then yeah if you have a look here we have our little uh this grows eventually this is like a pumpkin thing oh i'm so glad and then we should be able to get like the lancet fish because now we can fish up here we can get dark wood oh my god dark wood oh, i'd forgotten how busy this is also what i think is kind of cool um this is the tree house this this turns into sorry if that's a spoiler for anyone um <laughs> sorry this turns into the tree house and it's so weird to see it as like a rock um because that's how it like starts out and so it looks so different and now we can start collecting the ravens as well if we give them their five star meals oh this is amazing oh i'm so happy yeah no this was a good idea i'm glad i've opened this up i think it was very worthwhile i didn't realize like my forgotten lands um is pretty i want to say like empty if that makes sense like i don't have an awful lot of um trees in it i mean it's empty now on my main account because i've cleared it down but even before then there was so much like open pathway and stuff and now they're kind of is <laughs> so, like no pathway um but yeah this is amazing to see it's pretty cool i'm happy about that let's open up this little package here 
Okay, I mean, maybe that's kind of good. At least on a new save. Um, why don't I quickly just open up Fairy Godmother's house? <laughs> Go in there. <gasps> Talk to her, yay! Mm -hmm. Oh my, is it really? It couldn't be. Oh, let me have a look at you. Oh. <laughs> Tanya, oh, it is you, isn't it? Uh... I don't know how to be anyone else, and there's no one I'd rather you be, but you really are quite dear to me. Oh. Now, where is that wand? I, oh, I was sure, oh, oh dear, I'm holding it, aren't oh. I? <laughs> well then, I suppose that's one problem solved, isn't it? And now that you're here, perhaps together we can solve another. Oh, but let me get one more look at you. It's been far too long, my dear. Mm. It really is you, isn't it? And not that, that shadow of you. Shadow of me? Are you talking about the forgotten? Mm -hmm. Yes, but now I'm certain that it's you. What a relief. You can see I've been trying to solve a magical conundrum the forgotten left behind. Long ago, the forgotten stole the orb of remembrance and hid it along with some memories in the dreamscape. Uh, what's the dreamscape? <laughs> oh, you may not know its name, but you've been there before. Nearly every time you've closed your eyes. Mm -hmm. The dreamscape is the place between dreams and the waking world. The rules there... Well, they're a bit out of order, mm -hmm. and it's a fine place for hiding things, such as an orb, or perhaps memories you'd rather forget. What sort of memories did the Forgotten hide? Oh. I'm afraid I haven't the faintest idea. That's one of the reasons I was ho so happy to see you. Mm -hmm. Seems to me the Forgotten would want to forget the same sorts of things you might. Ah. As for me, well, I'm afraid I don't need a dreamscape or magic spell to forget things. I seem to do that all on my own. Oh. That's why I always tie my cape on, you know. Otherwise, I'd never remember where I'd put it. Uh, so how do we get the orb back? Well, that's what I've been trying to do here all along, but every tr spell I've tried simply hasn't worked. You mean, you've been in this pumpkin house the whole time trying to figure this out on your own? Yes, but I'm afraid I've only managed to bumble it. The Forgotten has hidden the door to the dreamscape behind a powerful illusion, and no matter what I do, I can't seem to lift it. Oh, but now you're here, you're magic. It's just like the Forgotten's. Perhaps if we combined our magic together. Uh, I'm on it. One illusion, dispelling, enchantment coming up. There's nothing in the world I admire more than someone who delights in their duties and doesn't see them as a chore. Now, before the night fawns parted me from the rest of the village, I managed to grab a handful of spell books. One enchantment seems to hold the most promise. Oh. Would you be a dear and gather some purified night shards for it? I'll take care of the ah. rest. Just meet me back here once you've found it. After all, what's lost must be found again. And on you, I know we can depend. I'll see you soon, dear. Okay, I'm really curious. So, um, let me go into collection and characters. Yeah, she's not, like, a friend yet. Can I even, like, talk to mm -hmm. her about anything else? Yeah, I have to do this storyline. <laughs> okay, and that requires more purified night shards. So I'm either going to have to... Oh, this is so weird that you can see the moon. I can't see the sun at the moment, but you can see the moon down there. It's so weird. Usually you see, like, a wiggly sun. Um... But yeah, I think because I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to convert all my onyx and stuff like that into night shards, or just spend a bit of time gathering it. At least we've got fairy godmother sort of open, even though I can't give her any gifts yet. <laughs> um, but we can at least fish for some lancet fish, and eventually, hopefully, we get enough. Um, dreamlight that we can open up mike and sully but yeah we we did what we wanted to do today so i'm happy with that and i'll wrap up this episode here i'll see you on the next one bye guys